You know, even if a ski resort doesn't have perfect weather for skiing, they can fix that by making their own snow. This is the science behind snow making, and this is the weather that you really need to make it happen. Ideally, cool temperatures and low humidity. And teens, temperatures in the teens are best, but if that air temperature is near 30 degrees, they can still make their own snow if it's dry enough out there. And here's why that's important. First, in the snow making machine, you got a couple of different inputs coming on through. You've got cold water near or even just below freezing, but not frozen yet. It's then hit with a blast of compressed air, and that compressed air is cold, which helps start off the process. It breaks the water down into really small particles, which are then kicked out of the machine. Now, when that happens, that compressed air spreads out, and the air will actually heat up. But those small water droplets will cool down down. Plus, if it's really dry out, you get that evaporational cooling, just another factor that helps it go from water into ice crystals. And that's how you fill a ski slope and have perfect snow, even if the weather doesn't cooperate.